hi guys welcome all to my youtube channel if you're new here thank you so much for always tuning in if you're a returning subscriber thank you thank you so much so today we want to cook jamaican omena and uh, please follow the instructions closely and you will cook a very yummy omena see these things do you like them eh may I always remove them from my omena they are so big they can hurt someone when eating them so guys I'm separating chaff from my omena. Yeah, that's it. that is what I'm doing. So come with me, guys. As you cook Jamaican, Jamaican omena, Jamaica. Oh, ja, ja, ja. <laughs> as easy as A, B, C, D. Don't drop off. If you're new here, kindly remember to subscribe because I'm that friend of yours and I need your support. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow and also share to your friends if you want to eat Jamaican meal. Jamaican male, kindly follow. Follow the steps and also remember to tag your friends to watch the video. And I will be very grateful. Thank you so much, guys. So come with me, guys. As we do this, Jamaican yo 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 yo. Oh, oh, Rastafara. Eh, eh. <laughs> anyway, I like Jamaican. But then I'm from Kenya. If you're from Jamaica, I'm from Kenya. And I love you so much. One day I will visit you in Jamaica. So guys, follow closely. I'm just separating chaff from the good owner. So don't drop. So after I'm finished, I'll wash omena with nini very hot water. Make sure your water is very hot before washing your omena wash it at least twice and it will be clean super clean so i'm always very tired ikifika when it reaches that the time that these omenas in a quirky dog i get lazy because well, see them anyway let me finish then we wash them so guys we are ready we are ready to start cooking the jamaican jamaican yo yo the jamaican meal so here is the recipe so guys here are our ingredients we have omenas the main meal onion powder this is onion powder cooking oil the cooking oil should be mingi sana it, it should be more more you should use a lot of cooking oil we have crushed ginger and uh, garlic we have tomatoes we, are, we also have onions cooking coconut cream and salt and also hot water to wash our omena so come with me guys remember to wash your omena twice with hot water fully boiled 100 degrees boiled since omena comes from a very dirty place you always need to wash it very well so here's our omena this is round one so we need to add water again after pouring this we add another water So we are done. Here is our pan. We want to start cooking.
So we are adding oil, oil. Make sure you use a lot of oil. Yeah, I think that one is enough. Yeah. After that, you add onions just immediately. So after that, you add onions. And make sure you control your heat. Don't use a lot of heat because it will burn and not ready. So you control your heat. You, I need to add my omena before the onions turn. So they turn together. You spread the omena well. Make sure you spread it well. Yeah, it's doing fine. Make sure your heat is, is not too much, you see. I've controlled my heat to just at least. So after that, I should add some salt, then leave it to cook. Need to add some salt, then I will leave it to cook. Again, in Omena, don't use a lot of salt because people will not love it. You just use a small amount of salt. I think that one is enough because we're going to use Reiko cubes. Yeah. Now we should leave it to cook for some time. That is at least five minutes. Then we will check it. I request you guys to always use minimal heat. You see? Use minimal heat. Omena takes time to cook. It does not cook as quick as many of you think. So this is the Jamaican way, you see? They are getting crunchy. Until the crunchy is when we can add onions. So, as you can see, it is somehow dry. Let me add some oil so that it can cook well. Yeah, I'm going to use a lot of oil. It's not that easy. It uses a lot of oil. So, at this point, it is somehow getting brown, golden brown. We can add crushed ginger and garlic. Here are they. You can use you can use a spoonful of them. Yes, so it takes time to cook. We don't have we are not in a hurry, we're just giving it enough time to cook. And it seems the oil is not enough. Let us add a little. Anyway, it's okay. It's well let us give it another five minutes so that it can be they can be fully brown yes guys so guys everything is okay as you can see my omena has turned to golden brown yes does it so i'm going to go with my onions make sure you use a lot of onions i mean a lot of them a lot of onions so that your mena can be the jamaican with the jam if you know the tingo you know the tingo this is the jamaican way by the way this is the tingo in jamaica so we go next to these these are the reiko cubes yes then you add them you add them well 
Then last but not, ah, this is not the second last thing that you're going to use. This is the onion powder. Let's add it. Go in with onion powder. Yeah, I think that's enough. You don't choose a lot in Jamaica. So you mix them well. Then you leave it. You leave it to cook. But now at this point, you can increase the heat so that the onions can cook. You can increase, increase the heat just a little bit so that the onions can cook. The tomatoes can cook well as you continue stirring. So at this point, our tomatoes have cooked fully. Yeah, it looks yummy. I think the camera does not give this omena. There's not yeah, any justice because this omena looks yummy. So we are going in with coconut milk. If this one is not enough, we can use to oops. Just poured anyway. This one is not enough, we can use two. The Jamaican omena has a lot of coconut milk. Yeah, it smells yummy by the way, guys. It smells so yummy. I think we can add a little of another coconut cream. Here we are, guys, with another coconut. I think we are not going to use all of it, just half of it, because we have already used one pack. So if you know the tingo, you know the tingo. See how mena, see the way our mena looks yummy. This is so yummy, by the way, guys. If you don't lick your hands, then you don't know yummy foods. This omena is so yummy. Very, very. So if you need water, here is the point that you can add water, but with me, it will stay like this. Because I want it like this, the Jamaican way. If you know the tango, you know the tango. So guys, I decided to add a little water because of my baby. She will not enjoy if it does not have the soup. Wow, yummy. Guys, try this. Try this. Try this. The Jamaican way. Try it. Nice. Oh, my God. Wow. No, God, please.